Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to get those big, beautiful butterfly curls or just the blowout look or whatever you want to call it. So first I will tell you that this look does look better if you have layers in your hair because it will fluff out a lot more and be more voluminous. <laughs> but um, so yeah, but either way you can kind of do this look with what you got. So. Let's do this. <laughs> My hair is right now, it's a little bit wet. I had showered and I was doing a couple of things. So um, I'll just first spray it with, and you can do this with wetter hair. Either way, you're gonna be blow drying it out. So um, I'm gonna spray it with the Pureology 21 Benefits Spray. Um, this will just help protect my hair and do all the good things that I always talk about. So. Next, I'm going to be using IGK's Volume and Thickening Mousse right here. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Can't tilt it all the way over. So I'm just going to put it like that much in my hand. I'm going to just put it in. Whoa. <laughs> And I'm just gonna rub it through my hair. So this is just gonna help get that big volume that we want. And just mostly run it through the mostly run it through the root area of your hair. Um because this is where we want the volume is through here. So next we'll blow dry. So here we go. Okay, so um, you can already tell already that that foam mousse definitely is doing its job. <laughs> I can feel it. It's like fluffy through here. Um, I did use my round brush a little bit um, just because I wanted to smooth out my hair since it is naturally curly. I wanted to spare you some time from watching me, but if you do want more details on how I round brush my hair, I do have another video. I will link it up above so you can watch that if you want to but um but I didn't fully do it I just kind of did it in some sections just to like I said smooth it out a little okay now it's time for the rollers um I just bought this set on Amazon it comes with some bigger ones and some smaller ones so it also comes with little clips to hold them in so Okay, I'm going to start by doing the smaller ones up top, um, just because I have shorter hair on top, and we'll save the bigger ones for down below. The goal when putting in rollers is you want to make sure you're kind of almost over directing the hair so you can get that volume. If you're not over directing, it's not going to give you the volume because, like, let me just show you an example. So if I were to do it down here and curl it, this is not creating volume. So what you wanna do is make sure you bring the hair up like this. And just roll it over like this, so. So like if you can see on the side, the hair is sticking basically straight up. And that's what you want, is you want it to be giving you that volume. Let's see where it's... So cute. <laughs> so 
and then these ones around my face. I also I'm going to do them out and back. Same thing on this side. Wrap this around. Push the button. Okay, so this is just the front. So the rest of them now, I'm just gonna go through um, I'll do this kind of vertical back this way and then the other ones um, just going horizontally down. So. Same thing, you want to pull it straight up, make sure you're getting that volume. I will link these rollers down below. Um, so now that we got these wrapped, um, I'm gonna go through with IGK's dry volume and thickening spray. Just gonna spray kind of through these a little bit. should have used the smaller roller right there anyways here we go um and then i'm gonna blast it with the heat a little bit and then we're gonna take it out so this is not a heatless curl method by heating it up it's going to kind of mold the style and then we're gonna let it cool and that will set the style I also do this starting with dry hair mine was just wet and i wanted to throw the mousse in it um you can like i said if you're gonna do dry you can still throw the mousse in it before and do everything that i did without blow drying it. So here we go. I'm gonna turn down the fan on this just so it's not blowing crazy and messes up my beautiful style I worked so hard on. <laughs> so we're just gonna go through and heat them all up. And make sure too when you're heating them up, you wanna go with the way of your hair so it's not getting all frizzy so blow with the curl
Now that it's cooling, I'm gonna go through and spray it with some hairspray. What I've got today is Verb Ghost Hairspray. I like it, it's good stuff. And this bottle is aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> so, <laughs> also another reason why I don't like it. But, so I'm gonna go ahead and spray. this just cool down for a few minutes and then we will take it out okay so we let them cool off for a few minutes so let's take them out now and see what we got so as you take them out you want to try to help keep kind of the shape oh yeah look at that volume <laughs> gently So yeah, that look definitely gave me some volume. Um, <laughs> got some big hair. Um, I and I had to run through my comb a little bit on a couple pieces because they were kind of a little wonky, but yeah, this is kind of that big, big hair blowout look that you can get with it. So it does work. Um, I have a ton of layers. Um, if you have kind of longer hair, you're gonna get more of the almost, it will add a little bit more curl to it. The shorter the hair, the more of just like a flip kind of look you'll get, but yeah, there you go. Got it, so did its job. Go ahead and try it out yourself. Let me know how it goes or if you have any other tricks that you know about that helps get that big blowout butterfly look. If you enjoyed this video or learned anything from it, don't forget to click the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want more content. Thanks. Bye.